All right, y'all. So this is going to be from the front door. And I'm going to turn around. And this is going to be our house. And I am so excited. Um, this house comes with a deck and it is out here like this and turn back around the kitchen is huge which I love this is the laundry room slash mud room washer and dryer on this side and over here we have an actual sink with um, a bench and stuff for like boots and stuff like that and then we may have enough room here next to um, the wash area to put a refrigerator we will see about that if not it'll be over there on that wall because we do have a stand-up refrigerator freezer um, that we are going to be bringing with us go down the hallway this is a built-in um, it's for the TV and any type of other things entertainment wise that you want to put on there as we go through the first one this is gonna be Marcus's room it's a nice size room I think it's a 10 by 14 uh, or it may be a 10 by 10 I'm not for sure um, but this is a nice size room um, it does have carpet, which we didn't have carpet at our house. And then this one here is the bathroom right across from him. Um, lots of drawers, under counter space. Um, we probably will have to build in something in here next to the toilet, between the toilet and the shower, but we will see about that. Um, or maybe some open shelves, we'll see. And then this is going to be Layla's room. And then her room is also nice size. Um, the bigger room is Marcus's room, um, but she's little. She'll be okay with this one. With a nice walk-in closet, which she is gonna be pretty happy about. Um, I may do a second rack down here, um, but we'll see. <clears throat> And then last but not least, this is going to be our bedroom. Um, and in here, there are, as you can see, two windows. Of course, it's all recessed lighting throughout the whole area. And then this is the bathroom. Hi. This is the shower. Look at this shower. This is awesome. It's huge. And of course, soaking. I'm 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 happy about this one. This is the toilet area, excuse the toilet. And then a large walk-in closet over here, which I'm pretty excited about too. Um, I may have to add in some shelving in here just to make sure, cause these are really tall and long. Um, and yeah, you know, makes sense to add it in. Um, I'm undecided on where I would put the bed. I don't know if I want to put it over here on this wall. We have a queen size bed or on this wall. I know I do not want it on this wall. So this one or this one. We'll see. We'll have to see. And then, of course, maybe TV over here or based off of whether a bed is going to be TV, maybe over here on this wall. So we'll see.
I'm so excited, y'all. Okay, maybe excited is not the word. More like glad it's done no wit. The stress has not been completely removed yet because I'm pretty sure there's going to be other stuff that comes up as far as getting the house out there, improvement on the land, um, making sure that contractors are coming out there or things are not being delayed. Um, but that's about it. I'm excited. All right, Jerome, what are you most excited for in the new house and the land on this side? <laughs> what, um... Excited to move in. Um, I like the spacious kitchen. Uh, the living area is pretty nice. He's not gonna be using the kitchen, y'all. Um, I will <laughs> to pour my own cereal. <laughs> <laughs> um, I actually like the deck area. Me too. Anyway, um, I think the thing that I'm gonna love most about this is going to be, of course, the kitchen. Um, I'm most excited about only because it's a lar larger kitchen. It's not a galley style type of kitchen, which that's what we have right now. And it's just hard when you have people over or if you're trying to do the Thanksgiving and stuff like that. And yeah, over the past couple of years, we haven't had people over only because of COVID. But, you know, once things start dying, dying again, um, of course, we're all vaccinated. And I mean, not that, that it matters, but it doesn't matter. Um still um making sure that like everybody that's coming to the house is gonna be okay and they're not coming to the house to get sick so we will have people over more if they're willing to do the drive i'm just saying um but yeah and it's just a lot easier whenever you have a lot of space in the kitchen um so that you know everybody can just gather around and be in the same space not just needing only two people in the in the kitchen to do everything while everybody else has to stay out. So, um, because it gets too um, close in there. Anyway, so that's, I think that's what I'm most excited about. I'm also excited about the porch because, of course, y'all know I'm gonna have rocking chairs out there. If you didn't know, now you know rocking chairs. Um, and then, um, yeah, I'm just excited to get started. I'm excited to bring the animals out. I'm excited to decorate the house and get it the way I want it to be. And that's about it. I mean, I don't think I'm gonna be rushing on um, the house stuff because I'm just gonna be gathering things that I farmhouse style, because that is my style and that's what I like, modern farmhouse. Um, as I start gathering things, which I've already started buying a few things already. Um, and of course we have stuff from our current home um, that I'm gonna be bringing along with us, but yeah, pretty much. I'm just going to be making sure that uh, everything is matching and looking nice. And then we will start planting fruit trees and bushes and everything that I can to um, kind of get everything in order for our mini farm. I'm excited, y'all. And I'm so happy y'all are here to just watch our journey, y'all. I'm so excited. Anyway. Have a good one, y'all. Be blessed.